They're supposed to be gone. That's what Port Arthur Mayor Thurman Barty proclaimed during a news conference last week. The city plans to make people who've been camping out in front of the old Howard Supermarket along 9th Avenue to move out. You see, they're on private land, and a district court ordered the area vacated. Yeah, and today Port Arthur officials were supposed to begin the process of clearing the homeless encampment. 12 News reporter Christiana Ramos spent all day talking with residents about their next move. People living on the property tell me this week city officials have been surveying the partial fencing on the property, but no one has warned them about the court order. For now, people still remain on the site. You may remember trips with grandma to Howard's grocery store in the 80s. Nowadays, for people like Danny Washington. This is just my downfall right now, but I won't always be here. And Hong Tran, a veteran and former shrimp boat captain, the 9th Avenue site is home. I built it. Before I used to stay right there. Today, their home, along with many others, is being threatened after the 60th Judicial Court ordered the area be vacated. The residents had mixed emotions. Doesn't matter what you do for the country, they don't give a damn. If they find me a house, yeah, I would go. Mayor Barty says if the residents refuse to leave, they will be given a trespass warning that could include up to 180 days in jail. Doesn't matter how many they are, hurt me, uh, whatever. Let me go. I will revenge, fight back. I would not go anywhere. I'll just get my trespassing charge. Last week, Barty also told 12 News he would reach out to HUD on options to find permanent housing. We followed up with him today. Have you personally went out to HUD or the Workforce Solutions to ask them to help with these people? If they are willing to follow the rules, they know the agencies that they can contact. They know where to go for drugs, okay? They know where to go for alcohol, okay? So why don't they know where to go to get some help for shelter? But Danny Washington fears he will be unable to find housing after he lost important documents in a fire six months ago. Mayor Barty tells me people living in nearby houses have asked for the site to be cleaned up and the city has tried to help many times. Now it's time to finish the job. Still no word when the area will be fully cleared. In studio, Christiana Ramos, 12 News.